Oh, hello, and this is that random gamer again, and it, here we are again with Call of Duty, well, Call of Duty, sorry, <laughs> Complete Heroes 2, online, 3v3, I am playing as the Germans, because I really do enjoy the Germans, actually, I really am enjoying this faction. I mean, I will probably do some um, gameplay of the Soviets, but that will be coming uh, sooner, well, later. Later than sooner, I suppose. I would like to get a few more games out of me playing as the Germans, of the sort of words match, is it the word match? Voice match? You know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> right, so it's kind of even actually. We have like two level forces on each, and like a ten, well, thirteen and a twelve. So I mean, that guy's okay. Now I wonder where um, I will be located. So the German bases are generally up, well, always up here. Soviets down here, and then the town and this area is it's kind of like a countryside area, I suppose. But we need the fuel and this fuel. Now, I don't know why I'm taking forever to load. I've noticed this problem in the beta. Like, sometimes it can be uh, one person who will take forever to load, or it could be an entire team. But, oh, it seems to be me when I'm, like, recording. Maybe it could be to do with that. Who knows? But we'll find out soon. So, come on, finish loading. Come on, you beauty. Uh, the thing I do like about the Germans is the fact that you can build bunkers and like actually put MG42s on them, like have medics. It can, it really does give you a boost in the field. Like I'm, I'm not even kidding you how much it helps. Okay, so here we go. Right, so what I'll do is, uh, oh, strange, where at the bomb? That's something I wasn't expecting. How odd. Anyway, let's see, calling more pioneers. Generally the same thing as I normally do. Rush straight through the fuel. Just um, tell these guys. There we go. Oh, it's, it's always nice to tell them what they're in. Kind of makes people play the A game. <laughs> Which is kind of funny, actually. Um, let's build our... Infantry company. And then we can get some MG42s out. <laughs> exactly. You see what I mean? Okay, so let's get this fuel locked down. Alright, our infantry company should be built soon. Well, soon enough. Go on, let's get this fuel. Hopefully the Soviets aren't doing the exact same thing. It is closer to the Soviets. I think. I don't... I, I think it is, yeah, actually. So have to cross the river. Um, so it's not too far, really. Okay, so we'll capture this point. Taking it now. Um, let's get our MG42s out there. So what we'll do is we'll put the flag down here of our second group of pioneers to go out and capture this. Ah, so they did have the same idea. But the thing is, I am going to capture this first. Okay, so we are getting a lot of resistance in the middle here. So what we're going to do is we're going to pull back here. Now this game m can, well, it appears to be quite challenging at the moment. Definitely different to the other games I've had on this map. Okay, so the MG42. We're going to have to send this up here pretty much as soon as possible. So let's get... Ooh, some grenadiers out as well. Okay, so I'm going pioneers are taking massive casualty, uh, casualties. Casualties? Casualties. To try and get them out of there. Okay, so... Wasn't quite expecting that much. Right, so let's get in cover here. They're going to try and go to that point. Where's our MG42s? They're coming up here. Right, we definitely need to secure this area. Right, so they had the idea. They um, they definitely had the idea of taking the fuel as well. I mean, I can't blame them. It's a good strategy. It really does make a massive difference to the game. We'll build another MG42, then probably send out some mortars in a few minutes. Oh, that's cheeky. Yeah. Right, we can set up there, try and help that guy. Let's get set up there, actually. Come on. Ah, I hate that. Come on, we need to get moving, we need to set up. Right, pioneers, let's take these guys out, move for the fuel point. Right, so they have conscripts, infantry, of course. Right, let's get the machine gun set up. Come on, quickly. Right, the grenadiers are going to be helpful here. Suppress them, keep them down. 
recommend them using Prey for the Grenadiers. Okay, so they're in cover there with the Clumps groups. That's okay. At least we'll be able to set this point. Now the thing is with the um, Soviet army, they always are pretty much on uh, the level of like mass infantry rushers. Can't, well, not specifically rushers, but you know what I mean. So we'll capture this victory point with the Grenadiers I've already sent up there. Um, sent our... Oh, that's unlucky. Right. We need to get this point. I want this fuel point. I don't care what it will take to take it. It is going to be mine. Right, at least we're taking this certain victory point, so let's deny them some extra points. So can we build our next thing? Well, soon enough. Right. At least I've got my MG set up here, so that's okay. Start them firing there if they can. Okay, so our Grenadiers. Second group of MGs is here. We'll have them set up in that building. But we'll have them go down the street, so then hopefully my Soviet enemy won't notice them. Right, let's get these guys set up here. Right, they'll go for that. No! That way! I want them that way. So now, let's see, can we build our next building? Yes, we can. I would like to get some armed cars out. Okay, so they've set up there, which is annoying. Now what we can do is we can fire a rifle grenade into there. Come on, let's get this set up. Fire! There we go. That did some damage. We'll get our grenadiers to try and lock down the point. Because if we can take it, it, it doesn't matter if we hold it like for however long, as long as we keep it. Well, as long as we have it, should I say. There we go. So what we'll do is we'll move these MG42s up, secure the church, which will give us um, direct... Oh, hello. That's not very nice. We'll have to send the grenadiers down here to secure the ammunition uh, port again. Ammunition depot, sorry. Okay, so they're coming into there. Well, that's a death trap, to be honest. Two MGs, they're not going to make it. Here we go. So what we'll do is we'll fire a rifle grenade into there, if it is possible, which it is. Which is good out there for a Molotov in there. That is not good. Definitely not good. Right, so they're taking... Oh, no, they're burning. Oh, you little cop. God damn it. Okay, so they seem to be going down that way. He's gonna throw another Molotov. Oh, you little bugger. That is such a little dirty tactic. Alright, send them back to the church. Let's get them in there. Okay. Right. There's our armoured car, so what we'll do is we'll send this up here, get some armoured support up there. Probably recruit another one. So let's see. So we can't get to Battle Phase 2 yet. They're going to just throw them in the Molotov, I can see it now. Where's our Grenadiers? Okay, so they're here. Stop throwing Molotov! Dick! Okay, at least the armoured car's here. Okay, so they have Molotovs. What we'll do, we're going to send the armoured car straight up there to take out the Molotovs. Cannot let them get advantage. Oh, that's the MP squad down. Okay, so what we need to do is we need to push on these. We need to take the victory point. We are taking um, area, land, uh, area back, sorry. Right, so here's our second armoured car. Let's send that forward to the front. Right, so we'll escalate to battle phase two. Right, bring our armoured car back. We don't want to lose that unnecessarily. Celery? Celery. Celery. You know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> it's a unique skill to be able to commentate and play at the exact same time. Right, we'll build a small fire there. Right, so our armoured car's here to assist. Alright, we want to take this point. There we go. Now that's the armoured car from here, why not? Might as well see if we can take out the infantry units and run away. Okay, so let's see what we can do with these armoured cars. Um. You know what, why don't we raise a bit of hell over here. So we'll send our armoured cars over there. And then what that will do is, that will ultimately screw things over. Actually, we'll keep this one armoured car over here, but it doesn't make sense to use both. We'll uh, take down this one. There we go. Nicely done. 
pull it back down here, keep it safe. Our second armored car, let's see what he's doing. Use him to help secure this area. And can we build our next depot? Yes, we can. So we can get some armor out. Now, uh, what will I deploy? Maybe the Stug, actually. Well, I don't know, depending. If they get armor out before we do, then I will deploy the Stug. But if not, I will go straight for the Panzer as usual. This will send that up there. Actually, no, these are guards. Oh, this makes things worse. Always makes things harder. Right, we need to get some more infantry into the uh, battlefield again. So let's send some more MGs. Right, so we're almost ready there. Um, our armoured car is ready to assist up here. So what we'll do is we'll send the armoured car there, just to scout, I suppose. Right, so we can't afford a panda or anything yet. No matter. Okay, so what's going on here? Oh, this is not that good. Right, run, basically. Right, the armoured car that is wanting to... It needs to be near the fuel point, because that's the most important part. So let's send these MGs back up there. So the two MG teams up there. Right, so we can escalate, escalate, escalate to phase three. Right, I'm not going to do that yet. Okay, so use armed car to like push the lead by. Oh, well, apply pressure to my side. That is cheating. I am sorry, but I just saw that happen. As an inhuman pro. No matter, we can take it back. Right, so this seems to be down here, so what we'll do is we'll set up here, get the armored car behind them, flank them basically. Right, so our MGs are going up nicely. Um, can we call our Panzer yet? No, we need 115 fuels for about 20 off. Right, there we go, set up. Fire. Okay, so they're going for the victory point. Oh yeah, however... La la la. What we need to do, however, is we need to keep this secure. So I'll put one MG team there, then I'll have the other MG team to set up in this building over here. The builds are just lifted, so that's good. Why is our armored car taking so much damage? Uh, that's actually quite ridiculous, to be honest. No matter. Okay. So we are getting pushed considerably. Right, so let's uh, retrain this um, Grenadier squad. Right, can we get our Panzer? Yes, we can. That's great. I mean, the fact that we hold the fuel points now is great. Okay, so there they are. But we should be able to gain cover. Oh, okay, what we need to do is we need to get this uh, mortar out there. I mean, tear the mortar out over there. Now, the fact that they have all these rifles is like, yeah. Oh, they have tank. They have a T-34. Uh, not good, but we have a flame wagon over here, so that's okay. Let's do a reconnaissance aircraft with sweep. Right. Yeah, 234 soft 76 tank, at least it's not 235. That would be quite painful. Was it like a 90mm cannon? Something like that. Right, let's send our uh, grenadiers back up there. Uh, what we can do is we can send some anti vehicle, send some more grenadiers. That'll do nicely. Okay, so they're going for that one. Right, focus on them. I don't care if you need shot at all more, so just do it. Right, so our panzer's here. Now we need to keep this panzer alive, like, seriously. It's the most important thing. Okay. So me and my ally are being pushed back over here. Apparently I'm lagging. That's not very good. Oh, that was Right, we'll get our grenadiers in there, just keep them safe for the moment, try and lure the T-34 into a trap. Right, so our uh, anti-tank probably has arrived. So let's see, what can we get now? Um, well, that's quite smart, he's doing that. That's um, something I like to do, actually. What we can do is we can send some, um, what are these, Panzer Grenadiers up there, have them equipped with Panzer Strikes in the future. Okay, so as soon as we get some more men up there, we can start doing a push, and this is lagging quite considerably. I wonder what's happening, actually. Well, I'm not lagging. <laughs> Whatever. Whatever he wants to say. Okay, so they're making a push for the... What is this? This is a mortar half track. Okay, so now they're making a push. So what we'll do is we'll turn our tank this way. Um, have that take out the scout car, which should be quite easy. Oh, and he has a squad inside. How would the push this? Goodbye. 
Right, retrieve. Retrieve, don't want to get hit by any, like, uh, grenades. There goes that big one's dead. Plane wagon should kill these easily. There we go. Next, what we'll do is we'll do a um, reconnaissance sweep over this area. Have our grenadiers push on this area. There we go. Guys up there. We can bring a stug out, which would be very useful to bring more. Okay, so now they're taking some forces, and we are taking the victory point, and we're taking this victory point. Welcome to my graduates. Okay, so they're dead. Okay. What we'll do is keep pushing. Dead lag again. I apologize if it is me. It's me, I'm sorry, but whatever. Okay, so let's back again. Um, upgrade them with Panzer Shreks and can have these to hold down this area, I suppose. Okay, so we have the Blizzard Horror upon us. Alright, so what we'll do, we'll move the Panzer back, I don't really want to lose it. A bit over here. Oh, actually, no, we're going to support these guys over here. That makes sense. Right, so this unit here we can support. Bring her Stug in, which is great. Right, so then we have less than 300 points. So we are definitely winning at the moment. Send more heavy MGs up. Battle. I am, don't worry. Oh god, that was a bluff here. Right, so we have units suffering cold apparently somewhere. Oh crap, they have. Um, right. So what we'll do is we'll get my anti tank set up here. Actually, no, we can have it up to here. I'll do nicely. What is this? A mortar. Okay. So send our tank up this way. Nice, we've taken this, which is good. Actually, we'll have these guys to move up into this building, which will make them safe. Um, have them take residence in that building, keep them safe and warm. Right, so moving our tank forward. Try and flank this. Okay, so our stuck to went up to. Send these grenadiers back up. Right, we have more manpower than we currently can use. Okay, so let's keep moving up. Upgrade this with scopes, give it a bit more view. Right, destroy that fuel point. Right, so... Let's move backwards, let's move up here actually, I don't want to get caught out. Especially not by some anti-armour. Actually, we'll have this anti-tank um, gun set up there. Upgrade this for you. Move that there. And the Stug's going to be very important, especially if they keep bringing more armor. Right, actually, no, we'll send the Stug over there to help. Right, so they're bringing definitely more guard infantry, which is not great. It's not good. It's not going to help me in any particular way. But we'll have our troops set up around here just to, just to like help secure the area. So for now, these guys don't suffer any like cold. Okay, so what we'll do is we'll have our tank to come up here to spot these guys. Right, we'll call in a. Um, what do we call it? Right, uh, right, we need to get in here. We don't want to be on the ice. We don't not want to be on the ice and get cold. Okay, so they're here. Ah, uh, yeah, I hate that. Right, so we'll at least we take out that, so take the... Okay, there. Um, our tank can actually shoot at this building. Right, kill it. Right. Our stug, back. Right, this is not good, this is not good. Right, this uh, group of grenadiers, they can go and help take this back. So they have more rifles there, which is not good. We can call in another Panzer, however. Uh, we cannot escalate yet. We could have. Right, should suspend another panzer, which I feel will be great use. 
We are winning. We're winning slowly, but we are winning. Right, let's get these um, Panzer Grenadiers out, take this point, move this tank back. We do not want to get caught out by the Soviet infantry with their base. Right, so what do they have? Don't quite see anything useful. Okay, so we have another Panzer here. That's great. Um, I have this unit. Ooh, we'll we'll send half tracks up, and then we can like actually have our men reinforce up there. Right, gonna help right away. Right, call in another reconnaissance flight. Right, these Panzer Grenadiers, it would be helpful if they actually came in here and help. Right, so our MGs are keeping them pinned. I've got Panzer Grenadiers in here. Well, our Grenadiers, sorry. Um, how does this reconnaissance aircraft come in here? Right, so let's see if we can get a shot on that field. Done. Try and get it killed. Oh, that's Right, we need to find ground, we need to find ground. Come on, please. Right, we escape the line. Oh, that is not fair. Run, please get out there. This panzer needs to survive. What's it doing? Move. Schnell, schnell. Okay, so let's move the panzer grenadiers. Up till here, send this panzer back. Our second panzer has arrived, however. So let's have that down here. Alright, so I did lose that um, attack. Tank. Which is not the end of the world, however. Uh, we can't afford the flame projectors, which is not fun. We don't like the flame projectors at the moment. Right, uh, we have troops down here, so we can have the force. Well, does we use a... Nope. Okay, so we have our plane projector in here to help us. So we back out of the way. Do we not want to get caught? Yes, I'm aware that we are losing the sector. There we go. So it's always nice to like that actually. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Keep these guys dying. Fire a wire grenade into there, keep the half track movement. Okay. Well, okay, that's right. Move back, move back, move back now. Okay, so we have some uh, mortars over here. Lost words at the moment. Right, so let's look out our MGs in there, no matter. Uh, one minute. Right, so let's have this. Okay, so as long as we keep this moving. Okay, so it's up. Oh to the next level of anti. Uh, send some more Panzer Grenadiers into the village. Right, can we have this tank to do anything helpful? Right, we have that there. Do we still have our... No, it appears our half-track died. Right, let's fight this unit now. Right, so we've got two Panzer Grenadiers there. They... Oh, oh, oh. God damn it! did I lose my Panzer Grenadiers? Okay, so at least we can uh, stop this Panzer. What am I trying to say here? Actually, can we get a rifle grenade on? Please, 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 please. Yes, please, 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 please. Or a panzer pouncing. No, he's probably gonna die. Well, run. Right, let's have this panzer back. Do not want to get caught. Right, so our um, second panzer's almost fully repaired. Right, so we need to send more MGs up there. Done. Let's tank them up here. Have I already reconnaissance aircraft come in? Right, let's have our second panzer come up in a second. Right, it's fully done now, so that's good. Gonna come in there. Right, we can go for that mortar squad up here. No, but it's not a mortar squad. Crap, 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 crap. No, pull back, pull back, pull back. Pull back, pull back. Have them come down here. I don't want to get hit by that. Right, second panzer coming up here, along with another panzer. That's great. Alright, killing them. Second panzer coming in support, along with a third panzer. Good up, 
riverbank, which is dangerous. I'll give it that, it's very dangerous. Nice then making a move for that. <laughs> oh delight. Right, so we have both panzers here now. Just push. Right, so they're going for here, so we'll send our panzer grenadiers over here. Um, get them to throw some grenades into there. Right, let's, let's go take out that field gun. I don't think he can withstand two panzers. Wow, that did a lot of damage, however. Come on, panzers, kill it. <laughs> wow, that's doing a lot of damage. I was wrong. He can withstand two panzers. Holy crap. Right, let's have that move down there. Did I lose both panzers? Yes, I did. That's a bad move. Oh, well. Right, 22 points, so we are going to win this game, so it is okay. I don't mind losing two panzers at this point. Um, should we even bother escalators to the next phase? I don't think there's any points. What we'll do is we'll send some snipers in to see if we can. I uh, will probably start making more use of panzers in the future, actually. I quite like them. Right, so they're taking this. As long as the MG is basically hold them down, capture his victory point again, we're capturing the second victory point as well. Right, so they're calling an artillery strike. What we'll do is we'll get out of here as quickly as we can. Try and save this MG squad. There we go. Probably just in time. Right, so we'll hold this point. Um, let's upgrade with Panzer Shrek. Try and gain cover. I know, I do realise our troops are dying with cold. I'm going to do something about it. Alright, let's have our Panzer Shrek move up here. Try and take out that field gun. We can either use the Panzer Shrek or we can throw in like a bundled grenade. Oh, but victory anyway. Rude. Oh, that's his nude. <laughs> I misread that. Okay, so victory GG, good game. Victory is ours. Victory is ours, not that. I do love that line. Okay, so that's rank up for me. Yippee. Cannot wait to buy this game, to be honest. Okay, so let's see. Let's see what the statistics are. My allies did quite well there. We did very well, actually. So let's see. Come on, load. There we go. Right, so our meat shield was the MG42. Um, let's put GG here. Uh, Demolisher was the uh, scout car, which actually destroyed a building. The survivors was the Panzer IV. And the Panzer IV, as usual, is the most valuable unit because it just does so much. And I didn't do too much damage here. I did kill a few units. So kudos to my like um, allies, they did quite a lot of the fighting. Right, so yeah, they did quite a lot actually. Um, I'm not entirely sure what I was doing. I suppose it could be the fact that I was using more vehicles. It could be that I suppose, maybe more MGs. I don't know, whatever they did, they did it well. Anyway, so thank you for watching and um, there will be more. So um, yeah, <laughs> goodbye.